Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're having a wonderful day so far. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to create this solid granny square. So, I've already made a tutorial on how to do the traditional granny square. So today we are going to learn how to do this solid granny square. I did not cast off yet because I'm actually not done with this solid granny square. This is going to become even bigger. But yeah, I think we can get into the chest of things. Okay, so let's get into this. So because we're doing a solid granny square, I'm not going to create a chain or a foundation chain. I'm going to do the magic circle. I have a tutorial on how to do this. I will link it for you guys. Uh, I'm going to chain one and then I'm going to chain two as my first double crochet stitch. So we want to create clusters just for a foundation row for a solid granny so I'm doing three double crochet stitches chain two this is going to be our corner and then we're going to do another three double crochet stitches I'm going to chain two for our corner I'm going to do double crochets chain two and then we have to create the last side so we have to do three double crochet stitches and for the last corner we're going to chain two and now we're going to pull the loop of our magic ring to close the gap and we're going to do a slip stitch into this into the top of these first two single single apologies of these first two giant stitches slip stitch and we are done I just want to pull this tighter some more so we're sure it's not going to come loose I'm going to chain one and now we're going to turn our work and we're going to make a slip stitch into the first two chain space of the round one slip stitch and then we're going to chain two which will count as our first double crochet and we're going to do one more double crochet stitch into this two chain space, our corner. So this is then our increase. And for the rest of the side, we're going to make a double crochet into each double crochet stitch of the previous round. That's two and three. When we get to the corner, we make two double crochet stitches chain two now again our increase at the corner two double crochet stitches and then one double crochet into each double crochet of the previous round I'm gonna chain up we have to do into this two chain space two double crochet stitches then we chain two we're gonna do again two DCs, double crochets, and then three DCs, one into each of the DCs of the previous rounds. Just make this neat. Okay, then we're at the corner, so we're gonna put two DCs, two chains. Two DCs again, one double crochet into each of the previous rounds, double crochets, go, 
and then we need to create two double crochets into this corner here chain two and then we're going to make a slip stitch into the second chain of this starting two chains slip stitch we're going to chain one and we're going to turn our work again as you guys can see we're starting to form our square and it's nice and neat and it's a lot more solid than the traditional granny square now I'm going to slip stitch into the two chain space again I'm going to chain two for my first DC and then I'm going to make another DC into the two chain space and exactly as the previous round we make one DC into every stitch of the previous round until we get to the two chain corner we're going to make another increase by means of putting two DCs into the two chain space chain two and another two DCs into that two chain space so we are at the corner we make one two DCs chain two two DCs again there's the next corner and that's all that there is to it for a granny a solid granny square so this can be very meditative the only time you really need to think about what you're doing is when you hit the corners and then you just do your increase and the rest of the sides is just straightforward with another corner let me show you it again two DCs, two double crochets into this two chain space two chains for the next corner and again two DCs into the same space here so let's do that one two DCs two chains two DCs into the same two chain space and that's it I'm gonna work a few rows for you guys and then I'll come back and you will see the final result and there we have it I've done one two three four five rounds in this granny square you guys can see it's very easy if you have enjoyed this tutorial and found it helpful please subscribe to my channel for future tutorials and give this video a thumbs up have a wonderful rest of your day